Lesson 3, Two-Color Knitting with the KH910. This chart tells you which mylar is for which type of knitting. The manual's your friend. Page 2 of the manual starts the explanation on how the pattern selector works. Some parts of the pattern manual have complete instructions on program entry. For ease of learning, we're using the same mylar as the manual, number 4, 17. Let's practice the EWRAP cast-on. The EWRAP cast-on is a popular cast-on. Ready to get knitting? Let's go! Turn your yarn counterclockwise over the needles and pull through. Pull the needles forward to working position and knit across. It's easy peasy. Load your mylar and turn on your machine. Move the carriage across the full pattern knitting. Pattern input. Put the carriage into KC1 and knit across to the right. Push MC and add your second yarn. Knit until your mylar resets plus one row. This is the result of the sample. Now let's look at pattern A, a centered single image. This is where the KH910 becomes special. The yellow and green key adjust where the patterns start and stop. Pattern input. Make sure you've the same width of your pattern on your pattern input. K 
carriage to KC2 and knit across to the right. Push MC and add your second color. So we need to prevent holes from forming around the centered graphic. This is how I do it. I don't like weaving yarn tails at the end of my project, so I let my knitting machine do it for me. You can see the image has no holes, and you cannot see the weaved yarn tails. Pattern A plus B, multi-patterning, separated image. Pattern input. You're positioning images left of center and right of center this time. The carriage is to KC2, knit across to the right. Push MC and add your second yarn. Use the same method of gap prevention. You can see how the 910 happily separated the pattern. It's shocking. Same image, two times, same line reversed. The exercise from page 55 of your manual. The nice part about the 910 is when you push the M key, it will always go to where it wants you to put a number. And the book gives you good color-coded guidance. Pattern input, KC2, knit across. MC and add your second yarn. The instructions do not change to prevent gaps. We get kissy fish. 
and now a different take on the centered image, double width and height. All instructions are found in the pattern book on page 12. Pattern input, KC2, knit across, MC, and add your yarn number 2. Knit until your mylar resets plus one row. And boom, you have a sweater front. It's a good time to practice the latch tool cast off. To prepare for latch tool cast off, tension dial 10 for one row. This provides adequate give in the stitch to allow the latch tool to insert and pull the yarn through. Bring forward all needles. Then loop through loop toward the yarn tail. Would I personally use the MC Basic Knitting? Nope. It looks nice on the outside, but it's very messy on the inside with yarn floats, and they suck. I'd rather knit double or ladder back jacquard. Here's your homework from this session. Do a tension swatch 35 left and 35 right for each of these basic methods. Happy knitting!